What up, dog? Oh, yeah, let me touch on the subject, right? So it was the subject going around with some females was making comments. I love women. Y'all so fucking one-sided, y'all need your ass to smack. Stop focusing on your ass and use your brains instead. Start doing brain exercises instead of all the booty crunches and curls. You bitches need to exercise your brain. <laughs> like, for real, for real. And I don't mean, like, with calculations and shit. I mean, change your perspective on how you see shit and think. Nigga, try, try and shift perspectives for a change. Stop trying to get everything to go your way. Stop trying to think everything's supposed to be your way. Like some spoiled-ass little kid. You a whole grown-ass woman trying to run around here and raise families and shit. You can't do that and you a fucking little girl. In a grown up body, stop playing. Wake your dumb ass the fuck up. You still running around this motherfucker seven years old just with big ass titties. But anyway, let me drop this on you. I don't want to hear no comment about no woman talking shit about no man because he done got a bitch pregnant and then went out and cheated on a bitch. Well, let me show you what you bitches fail to realize. Bitch, y'all run around here and you get pregnant by niggas and don't even know who the baby daddy is. So until you fix that shit, bitch, you got no words, got nothing to say about some nigga knocking something, running around here fucking somebody else cause you're, while you're pregnant. When, line, no time, when nine times out of ten, it ain't even his motherfucking baby. So bitch, don't be running around here trying to make bitches feel bad for you cause some nigga fucking around on you that you fucked around on already but you don't want to tell the 100% truth, bitch. That ain't even his baby. So why you talking about a nigga pregnant, fucking around on you cause, and, he, and you pregnant? Bitch, that's not his kid. So now, nah, let's address these nasty ass, loose ass women that don't know how to keep their fucking mouths and their pussies closed that run around here getting pregnant by more than one minute like pinning the baby on another motherfucking nigga. That's nasty as fuck. And then the whole time this nigga sitting up fucking his baby mama thinking it's his baby mama when it's another nigga baby mama putting dick up in there with a whole another baby at. A whole nother nigga baby at. That's disrespectful as fuck. You clowns need to sit y'all asses the fuck down and recalibrate yourselves. You're not finna keep sitting up shooting shots at niggas saying, Oh, this is so horrible when a nigga do this. It's so horrible when a nigga do this. Bitch, you the only motherfucker on the planet who know the baby yours. Nah. Nigga, when I'm in, when I'm in it's gonna be mandatory motherfucking DNA testing. Ain't not one bitch finna be able to pop no baby out her pussy without having that baby tested for DNA to see who the fuck the daddy is. Because a lot of you hoes don't know. If y'all did, Maury Povich would not still be running on TV with his old motherfucking ass. That nigga would have been able to go pass in pieces and shit. But no. Nah, because we got some old retarded ass women running around this motherfucker who ain't credible worth a shit but want all the credit in the world. And niggas sitting up believing every word come out their mouth knowing they some goddamn liars. Running around this bitch thinking shit's supposed to be their way. Women, women don't rule the world. Let's get that shit straight. And if women did ruin the world, it's W-O-M-B-M-A-N. Not you motherfuckers, but the whole race. All y'all a bunch of bitches in, in my book, the way y'all act. <coughs> Man and women alike is women. Man and women alike is men. You dumb motherfuckers, dumb motherfuckers. At the end of the day, you like to confuse the workers. God, God ain't confused. God know he he made a motherfucking plug to go in the socket. You bitches putting sockets in the back plug and shit. Thinking you supposed to get some fucking power. Sit y'all hoe asses down some motherfucking where. You disrespecting the very earth you walking on in this bitch in the very air you breathing in the very water that you wash your ass up and you drink, motherfucker, if you even do that shit. Oh, and by the way, why you all be, if you want to be funny, you don't wash your ass that much, that's because I got you whole spying on me all goddamn day, looking in my house. Nigga, I can't even lift up my left, I can't even lift my left nutsack and scratch that bitch with my right index finger without you motherfuckers watching me, nigga. Stop playing. How about one of you motherfuckers come over here and bust some of these pimples on my ass? Oh, I don't got none of them. Well, you can surely enough come over here and help me scrub, scrub these nuts and get this king dick of washing, nigga. Straight up like that, nigga. Don't act like this. Don't act like I'm not Eddie Murphy in real life, motherfucker. Get over here and watch this world, motherfucking penis. Since y'all want to be all peeping times and shit. You ain't got to peep and you ain't got to be time. I can call you by your real motherfucking name. You can address me as your, your highness. Or you can just shut the fuck up and lift these bars and get to scrubbing. That part.
But until you, until then, as long as you still eye spying with your little teeny in your ass, big ass satellite eye, and got motherfuckers running around this bitch, and I got some kind of fan club on one end and a diss fan club on the other end, nigga, don't come for me. Go for yourself. Put yourself in a package. Deliver yourself from yourself. Because you need to get the fuck away from yourself. Because your motherfucking ass ain't no good for yourself, let alone nobody else. That's what we're trying to tell y'all. The guns ain't the problem. The drugs ain't the problem. You bitch are the problem. You nigga are the problem. Stop running around this motherfucker pointing fingers and everybody else. God, Satan, the devil, your mama, your daddy. Nigga, you still sitting up letting your mama, your daddy, God, devil, to say everybody do it to fucking dictate everything, nigga. And you're not going to be able to blame God because God is blameless. You can't blame the devil because the devil like to blame you. You can't blame Satan because Satan go against your ass for blaming him for some shit. Y'all niggas all loosey-goosey, cigarette butt-headed the fuck up with y'all decisions and shit. Stop playing. You niggas live in a fairy tale land. But guess what? The death toll is real, nigga. So the game ain't for play. That part. Get your motherfucking life in order. And you bitches, stop shitting on niggas at the end of the day. Like, he's some fucking toilet, my nigga. You ain't got no toilet paper to wipe your ass with after you shit on him. Or you got, he got to get up and go get the toilet paper for you, too. Y'all bitches something else. Y'all hoes nasty. And I'm going to tell you like that. Say I'm disrespectful. Bitch, you disrespectful for even, for even opening up your mouth not knowing who the fuck you was talking to. Because God can't be disrespectful. But one of you rat-ass bitches... You can be disrespectful as fuck. Remember that. Most high. I'm out, bitch.